Alright, today I am taking a look at a secret quest that did not make it into my secret quest video. Uh, so we're gonna head- we need to head to Coral to do that. The reason why it didn't- there's a couple reasons why it didn't make it in there. One of them is, uh, because I didn't find out about it until I was mostly done with the script. Um, and the other reason is because this quest doesn't always effectively work. So that's kind- that was kind of a problem. I mean, when you- when you're making a video about quests, you want them to be consistently you know, playable. Hopefully it works for us today. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. Uh, Hello. But first we need to find a lady named Casta Scribonia. Casta Scribonia. Also, I don't think this is gonna take that long. So after that, I'm gonna check out the secret quest in Battlehorn Castle, which is another one that I did do. Um, Hail, Sir Knight. Where is this Casta Scribonia lady? -a? I mean, <laughs> lady. Um, Where the hell is this lady? Okay, actually I think her house, is this her house right here? That's Castus Scribonia's house, but it's locked. So that's a problem. So she's probably out and about, I believe... Sometimes you can find her at the Mage's Guild, so let's head that way and see if we can see where she is. Here's the Mage's Guild. Alright, let's head on inside. You know, one of, the, one of the things I do really like about this quest is it is fully voiced, despite the fact that it is not an uh, attract quest. It is still voiced, and it is- it's- How do you do? Really is, it does feel like a quest when you- when you actually do it. Okay, so it doesn't look like Casta Scribonia is in the Mage's Guild. Which means, uh, she's probably- Greetings She's either out and about, or she's in her house, and we- what time is it? I can't wait while I'm in the air, that's a problem! I'm not in the air anymore, I'm down on the ground! It's 2.22, so she's probably eating somewhere. Hey, have you have any of you guys seen Casta Scribonia? I'm Contumelorius Florius. I'm in charge <laughs> of enchanted item recharge in the Mage's Guild here in Coral. <laughs> get it? In charge. Yeah, I get it, Contumelorius Florius, whatever. Okay, um... I'm looking Hi. for Casta Scribonia, hey, guys. Hello. Anybody seen her? Hello. Oh, wait, no, that's her right there, I think. Is that her? Yeah, I think that's her. Yes, Casta Scribonia! Service, um, Coral. So we need to ask her about Coral. Who is the fairest of them all? Other than myself. The proprietor uh -huh. of the Grey Mare is lovely. She and the guard captain would be a nice couple. Oh, they would, huh? Oh, that's very intri intriguing. Okay, Goodbye. so... Now that we've, uh, see, there's not, nothing that pops up because it's not tracked. But this is a quest, trust me. Now we need to find the captain of the guard, who I believe... I believe his name is Bitneld. So we just gotta look... The guard captains are always the only guards that don't wear helmets, so we just gotta look for a guy who's not wearing a helmet. Get a cure and keep your distance. What the frig? <laughs> Did that guy just say? That guy just said get a cure to the freaking, freaking. Oh, uh, what? Uh, homeless guy. That's that's not very nice. What a freaking jerk. All right. Okay, so um, if we can't find the captain, of the guard out and about anywhere around here. Then usually the best bet is to check in the guards' barracks. So let's head up into the castle. Uh, which one of these is the guards' barracks? I don't know. Oh, that one right there. Okay, sweet. Oh my god, he's right there. Hey, Bitnell. Yeah, that's your name. Bitnell. Brave deeds, friend. Taking the fight to oblivion itself. I salute you. Thanks, man. I'm a pretty, I'm a pretty brave man. All right, we gotta ask him about Coral as well. There are a lot of fine-looking women in Coral. <laughs> Yeah, but they're all kind of snooty and not very nice. Uh huh. All right. Um. Oh, Leave maybe. Me alone. Maybe we weren't supposed to find Bitnell first. Okay, so in that case, let's go find. Uh. Let's go find the the lady who works at the inn. I believe. I believe it's this inn right here. The Gray Mare. I believe. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Emfred. Okay, this must to be her. You. I'm Imfred, owner and publican of the Grey Mare at your service. A room? Or food? Whatever you wish. Um... Coral? Valis Odile seems upset. His boys are in some sort of trouble. Seems like you could handle trouble pretty well. Would you go see what's the matter? No, I'm not... I'm not interested in that right now. Alright, okay, yeah, so... This is kind of what I feared was gonna happen. Um... This Goodbye. is this is the reason why this quest doesn't always work. Uh, but I'm Hello. I'm not gonna give up. Sons, have you? No, I haven't. They went off into the forest to fight those I'm trying to do a video over here, and I'm not, I don't have time for this. Okay. Um. So, but don't worry, I'm not gonna give up because I'm actually gonna do something I have never done before, which is I am going to cheat. 
So if if you if you have a PC and you're trying to do this quest and you come into this problem, you write add topic, and then bit nailed. Oops, no space. Bit nailed topic. Okay, that should do the trick. We should be able Greetings. to talk to her now. An honor to serve you. I yeah, no, I know you're it. Okay, yeah, here we go. Bit nailed the curse bringer. Bit nailed. Captain of the castle guard. He seems like such a nice fellow. Too bad I don't see him in here very much. Yeah, that's too bad. That's too bad. Be seeing ya. Um, okay, so we've spoken to her. So now we need to head back to Bitneld. Um, I wonder if, you know, I wonder if you talk to her first before you talk to Bitneld. If maybe that's when you get the conversation. There's a bug. I don't know. I don't know what ha when the bug occurs or how it happens. I just know some people get the bug. I got the bug. I'm going the wrong way. I got the bug, so uh, that's definitely a problem for me. But you might not to get the bug if you try and play it. I don't know. I'm waiting. Hey, Bitneld, um, Coral. Oh, there are a lot of fine-looking women in Coral, but they're all kind of snooty and not very nice. Uh-huh. I see. Is that so? Well, that's just my opinion. Okay. All right. Oh, oh there are a lot of... We heard that, Bitneld. So what about Emfred, though? Emfred? She owns the Grey Mare, right? <laughs> yeah. I go to the Oak and Crozier. I'm a captain, you see, and the Oak and Crozier serves a better class of people. Oh, they do, huh? Listen to me. <laughs> I sure sound like a snob. Snooty, in fact, and not very nice. No, you that's what I mean, that Thanks. is what you sound like. That's a very good suggestion. I think I'll stop by the Grey Mare. And perhaps pay my respects to this Emfred woman. That sounds very good. Okay. Bye. Nice. We did. We did the yes. quest. Um, I don't know if there's anything more to that. I wonder. You know. There, well, there is one other thing, which, which is what makes this quest really feel like a quest. Which is, if we head back to the Gray Mare, uh, yeah, first we'd talk to her. You were Martin's her. friend, weren't you? Yeah. I'm. Yeah. Okay. Did you say something to Bitneld? That was very sweet of you. Now he stops by here every day. Wow. That's good. Bye. Um, I believe he stops by... I believe, I believe he's supposed to stop by right now, actually. Alright, well, he is supposed to stop by. I'm not really sure when, though, but I don't, I don't see him around, so I'm just gonna move on. Um, the other thing I'm curious about is... And I never I never thought to check this before, but the other thing I'm curious about is does Castus Scribonia say anything after you complete this quest? I don't know, but I want to find out! Oh, there she is. Hey! It's my pleasure. Please continue. So they got together. What do you think of that? I hear that Emfred and Captain Bitneld are spending a lot of time together. You wouldn't have anything to do with that, would you? Ah, uh, I would. You know me. Goodbye. All right, sweet. So okay. Yeah. So there's, you know, there's clearly, in, from my, from my opinion, this clearly was a quest that uh, was intended to be in the game and either got just cut out or they couldn't finish or or whatever. Or maybe oh, they never did. Right. I don't know. I'm guessing, I'm guessing probably the bug caused them problems and they just decided they didn't have time to fix it. So, alright, so there was that quest. There are actually a few more. I'm going to take a look at another one that, that I didn't want to put in just because it's not really quite what I was looking at. So let's go take a look at that. Okay, so the next quest I'm looking for is uh, at, at a place called uh, Fort Cald Corn or Cald, Cald Dorn. I can't remember exactly. It starts with a Cald or, or a C or something, but I believe it's around this area so i'm gonna head up here um what's that that's in, no that's okay yeah i believe it's around this area so i'm gonna head this way i went to the way Inn. in i start traveling north so now we just need to follow along this road and we shouldn't be we should be there in no time i almost said we shouldn't be there in no time i mean hopefully we're there and hopefully we're there in no time i guess technically no time is zero time so we shouldn't really be there in no time because that would be way faster than it's already been you know what i'm talking about all right, here's a fort. I don't. Th oh, that's. This is definitely not it. I don't know what fort this is. Fort Empire. Oh wow. That sounds like a pretty impressive fort. It doesn't look like an empire. Oh my god, it's a troll. Oh <laughs> god. Take that, you stupid troll. Is that all that's at Fort Empire? I don't know. Whatever. I'm not interested in Fort Empire. I'm interested in, in Fort called Corn or or something. I don't. I don't know. All right, what's this? Found Pui Piu Kanda. Oh, that's not what I'm looking for at all. Ah, ouch. Oh crap. I'm out of magic and there's another bear. Oh, oh. oh god, this is bad. This is bad. This is no good. This bear's doing some damage. Eat ah. this bear. Take that. 
Oh my god. Whew. That was a close one. Oh, there's a fort right here. Oh man, maybe this is it. Probably not, but, you know, maybe it is. I guess we'll find out in a second. Alright, what's this place? Come on, let me know. Fort Cold Corn. <laughs> I thought it was... Oh my god, it's actually called Fort Cold Corn, huh? I thought I was making fun of this place, but apparently... Apparently I was just calling it by its honest to goodness name. Well, great. Okay, so I waited until daytime, so that way... Oh my god, there's another troll. Holy crap. Take this guy down. <clears throat> Alright, so I wait till daytime so we can find this letter because uh, it's a lot easier to find things in the daytime than it is at night, so that's why. Okay, so apparently there's supposed to be a, like a letter or a map or something around this. Maybe it's supposed to be on this? There's a dead guy. There's a note. A key of hidden wealth and ten gold. Oh my god. This must be what I'm looking for. The sword leads the way. Half a mile. It's just past the big rock on the right. The sword leads the way. What sword? Oh, that sword. Hopefully I didn't accidentally kick that sword because if I did, I could be going the wrong way. Okay, so apparently we have to go half a mile on the right. Oops. Half a mile. It's just past the big rock on the right. Okay, so I guess let's head this way Ow! about half a mile. That's a big rock, but it's been like... Not even close to half a mile, so I guess let's head... Okay, so here's the thing. This is a big rock right here, but is this the big rock he's talking about? Or maybe it's that? Oh, there's a bunch of big rocks over there. What the frig? Is that the big rock? I don't know. I guess let's go over to this rock. And see if we can... See if we can find something. I guess probably a chest is what we're looking for. Just past the big rock on the right. Have I gone half a mile? I don't know what a half a mile is in this game. Have I been going the right direction? I don't know. Look how many freaking big rocks there are over here. There's like a billion big rocks. Who freaking wrote this freaking letter? Okay, so I just looked into it and it looks like I, uh, looks like the sword might have been pointing the wrong direction. Or at the very least, I went the wrong direction. I don't know. So let's get back to... Let's get back up to that chest. hi -ya! And let's see if we can... Where's the sword pointing? The so, so the sword's pointing this way. Yeah, the sword... Is pointing in the wrong direction! Alright, apparently the sword is supposed to be pointing... This way? And it's supposed to be somewhere near that? So, I guess let's go this way. I must have... I must have bumped into it when I jumped on there. How was I supposed to know? I didn't see the sword, I just jumped! Freaking stupid quest. Oh my god, is that's a chest! Open with container with a key! Note of bounty and a glass dagger. Wow, that was it? Note of bounty. Blessed are those who explore the unbeaten path. Fuck you! God damn it. That was a terrible... Th you didn't even send me in the right direction, you jerk! So I hope you I hope you guys enjoyed that. Make If you haven't seen my uh, secret quest video yet, then I recommend you go check that out right now. And I will see you guys on next Tuesday. Goodbye.